What's up everybody, Cataclysmic here with another Dragon Ball Legends video. Today I want to take a look at the Hyperdimensional Co-op Rebellion against Frieza versus Zarbon Extreme. Now this is the team we're going to be going with. I also would highly recommend grinding up this equipment, Let's Go. It is for any sagas from the movies. Uh, up to 20% key recovery last slot, 15% strike attack middle slot and you can just keep on farming the same mission for the red slot for that 10 percent special move damage in the bojack event in the last mission it does have it as the dropped equipment there's also this equipment in this event but i don't really see it as um that valuable if you do not pull any of the hair clan extreme members and uh so with that let's go ahead and see how gohan can do in this extreme co-op now i heard a lot of people saying that uh this this didn't get any easier and i would definitely agree with them this extreme co-op is still very difficult and i know that before this gohan released with him being the main boost unit it was very hard to complete with even super saiyan 4 gogeta and the uh half corrupted zamasus that i was matching with you're such a fool to go willingly to your death. Thank you! <laughs> so I did get lucky enough first round to get matched with another uh, Super Saiyan Gohan, so... I don't know why that didn't register there. I clicked the card and it just didn't work. I think it's more important to pop all of these green cards in the extreme one. Instead of saving them for the rush because you are getting that boosted game. Pop this. Pop the blue card. You get ready for the rush. Probably gonna pick green every time for these just because I want to make sure we get the rush off. I know that. In the past, when we failed the rush, it often led to us just losing after that. But I think we should be good because us both using Gohan, we both have a revival available. Right, Her shield's about to go back up. We've already got him well below half. So we got a flash or, or a dual wind. Alright. I'll save him. I don't think Zarbon's gonna do anything here. Alright, so he's got his rush ready and I got mine. I couldn't have gone. Dang it. I, I hit it too soon, that was my fault. Thought he was gonna just pull it right away. That's alright, we got a perfect that time. Still a lot of damage, so it doesn't really matter if you don't get the, the double rush in this one. If you are using a Gohan. Gohan, unleash your true power! I'll defeat you! So after reviving in co-op, our health is... Just over 2 million, which is really good. For someone that weak. All right, let's go ahead and move into the next fight. Nah. Calm. Here goes. Second fight, we are with another girl yeah. on blue impact right no. off the bat. We're gonna another one there, but. Hit him with glass up there. Ooh, yeah, that's gonna hurt a lot. Here I go. Alright, Rush is ready. Just gotta wait for him. Take that! Here I go. Huh? 
You got so many green cards. Um, let's see if we can get a duel in there for them. Nice. Alright, now we can go right into the left. Maybe. Rush? There we go. Alright, I'm still gonna pick green. I'm gonna make sure we hit this first rock dance. Oh, really? I hardly ever see the raid boss or the co-op boss choose green. That was really surprising. So this is good. We'll actually be able to see if we can manage to still beat this without any of those rock. It looks like if we do manage to get a second rush off, it shouldn't be a problem. Oh, that's so clean. Uh, Alright, so there's our revive. Completely fine, because now Zarbon is going to get annihilated. Goodbye, Zarbon. Got one thing. I'm my father's son. Alright, let's go ahead and snap with this. Ooh. I don't think I've even seen that uh, that Super Saiyan 2 rock pose. That was nice. There we go. We hit the rush that time. A ton of damage. That's it. Oh. For someone that I did not expect that. How foolish of you to challenge me. Here goes. So for the final battle, we got matched up with a Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta. And he is a two-star, so we'll be able to see. If you do get lucky and pull the Vegeta one time, will you be able to beat this if you get matched with another Gohan? I think I think we should be perfectly fine because Super yeah. Saiyan 4 being so defensive, he shouldn't go down too easily. I'm gonna try and hit this green real quick. Now we go. Nice. Perfect. Yeah, I couldn't, get more, couldn't have gone more smoothly, but we got all the strikes for our rush, so. Hopefully we don't get gas. Nice. How much damage? I'm guessing 17 mil? 20 mil? Okay. Yeah, see, Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta is still putting in some decent work. See, we still have a whole other life bar that Zarbon hasn't even touched. Tuna is insane for all content. If you manage to pull this Gohan, I think he's more valuable than both Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta and Zamasu. Just because he has that revival, you can take this guy into any event. If you die, it doesn't matter. He's gonna come back with a whole nother life game. So this should be it. This should finish him off if we don't get back. You know, I, I, I kind of take back what I said. That went way smoother. As long as you get matched with at least one Gohan, it seems like this extreme co-op is a cakewalk. However, it is kind of gated behind one of the members of the battle having Gohan. And I think that's a little disappointing. You know, like... 
even Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, if we take a look real quick at the bonus characters, they don't get nearly as many buffs as he does, I believe. So, Gogeta has 250% damage up, and Gohan has 250, 350. 25% damage up so it's a huge difference for the part 2 banner units over the part 1 LFs so that's probably going to be it for today's video if you completed extreme co-op let me know how it's been going uh, do you like extreme co-op personally I think it is good for co-op and I think it's going in a good direction with it being a little easier I think they should still have more boost units though for those people who have been playing for quite a long time like put some of the zenkai units up here for the boost units because a lot of free to play um players are going to have those zenkai units uh all the way boosted up um and with that i will see you guys in the next video